good morning you guys um welcome back to my channel so today we're gonna be doing a day in the life of a nail tech sorry if i am like super sweaty and gross right now i worked out for the first time in a really really long time um last night i weighed myself and it's like the heaviest i've ever been so i was like okay you know what like i actually need to focus on my health and do good for myself so um i think right now I made coffee, which was supposed to be for John because John just loved to work. Um, but I don't know. So before I would work out at night if I did work out. Um, but I was like, you know what? Like for myself, I need to just um, in the morning, first thing when I wake up, just so I'm like, just go and have that t a little bit of time to myself. Um, so right now I think I might juice some stuff. I need to wash all my stuff for juicing. All right, you guys. So first off, what I'm going to go ahead and do is put my spinach in. I went ahead and washed everything. So for if you guys did want to do the same recipe, you definitely make sure you actually like greens first. But all it is is a ton of spinach, a couple of cucumbers, and some pears. And you could put... A lemon in there and you could also put ginger in there the ginger honestly you guys if you guys don't like ginger you guys don't really even taste it unless you put a huge amount in there I usually just put a cutting in there and I'm good to go but this has been helping me and it's best to do your juicings when you are on an empty stomach making sure that it absorbs all in your body that is something that I have actually just learned so I've been doing that to see if I notice a difference and I do notice a difference in my skin since I have been working out in the mornings and doing my juicings and making sure I'm taking care of my body um, but yeah this is basically all you do I do want to get a better juicer eventually but I got this one this one is actually gifted from my grandma and she was just no longer using it so I do want to see if this is something that I'm going to always want to be doing or if it's just like something that I think I want to do and then maybe later on invest in one of the bigger ones. But yeah. Guys, and something that I do want to mention is you got, if you do do juicing, I heard that you could use your pulp for things. I don't know um, what different things you could put with your pulp. I have never tried it, but I've seen um, on the internet that you could use like for dog treats and a whole bunch of other stuff and like um like spaghetti sauces and things like that so i think maybe if i were to keep the spinach separate i would use it for like a a pasta or something but i'm gonna take my juice over here and i am just going to finish getting ready i already made my bed um i've been trying to make sure like i'm getting up earlier so i'm trying to start a better routine in the morning and just get going be refreshed um do everything that i need to do because i feel like i would i'm not even kidding you guys i would lay in bed till like probably like maybe sometimes nine um depending on like my day and stuff and especially it's like the days the baby and me are home by ourselves and i'm just taking care of online things i do not get anything done so um today is the start of doing all of that so hopefully i will be on this this schedule for a while um and i'll be able to get more done because even on the weekends i want to get up early i do not want to sleep in just because sleeping in really messes up my schedule so i need to make sure i'm getting up on the treadmill and stuff just because in the mornings i feel like i don't know like i could schedule my day down from there but it's like by the end of the day i'm like oh I'm tired. I'm this. I'm that. I make excuses. So guys, I'm just going to finish this. And then after I'm going to do a cup of water. And then while I have my clients, I do drink my coffee. And then um, I usually try, but I'm not successful at it. I try to drink more water. But I am going to be trying to be better. Um, let me go ahead and jump in the shower, do my hair, and get started on my makeup. All right, you guys. I just finished my drink. Um, now I'm just going to go ahead and start getting ready. I'm just going to sit on my bed. I'm going to put on some music. Um, to get ready, the foundation that I am going to be using is this. Oop. Sorry, it's a little messy, but it is the Estee Lauder. I wear shade 3W 1.5. Tawny, I think. Oh, no. Tawny is my other shade when I'm lighter, but this one is fawn. Sorry. 
but usually my go-to palettes are these ones right here but oh my son's toys in there um but i think i'm gonna switch it up a little bit i seen a makeup or makeup look on one of my other things so i might just replicate that just so i could match my outfit a little bit so yeah um this is not normally something i would wear just because it is super bright but since my mom bought it for me i'm just gonna wear it and try it out maybe i might find that i actually like wearing bright colors um we'll see all right you guys i'm gonna go ahead and get ready all right you guys i am finished getting ready i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my fit for the day i just wear a maxi skirt i like wearing maxi skirts especially like i just want to stay cool and i want my legs to be covered just because since i get allergic and stuff i don't like the nail dust on me and then my little top um i believe this is like a little bralette i think um but the ones that my mom had gotten me i got this one she got me this one this one's super cute I love the print on that. I feel like that's really, really pretty. And then this one right here. So I tried to show you guys earlier, but the um, my lighting was just horrible. But I do have my first client. I might have a not as busy of a day as I thought. Ooh, does this lip color look crazy? Mm -hmm, I don't know. Oh, well. I was trying to match my shirt a little bit. I know my lips, they don't. They're kind of more peachy, but instead of having the clients that i had i might have one cancel because her daughter had um is running a fever so she is one of my regulars that's like always on her appointment and then i accidentally actually book double booked my client one of my clients that i had from yesterday instead of booking her for only yesterday i booked her for today too i don't know why i did that so and then my other one she ended up getting a cold and honestly you guys with my clients that they do get cold i'd rather them let me know and just not show up just because like rather than just not show up just because a lot of times like if they come and they're sick, I know sometimes it's like, especially when it's like my regulars, um, I'm really afraid of getting, or like, I don't want to get sick. My whole family gets sick if I get sick, you know? So, um, I really, 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 really don't want anyone to get sick. So I'd rather them cancel their appointment. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and set up. I usually like to put a movie on for like me and my clients just because it's like it usually takes me about two hours to finish their appointment unless they're super long nails. My super long nail clients, they do take maybe like an hour and a half at the most. This is like when they're getting like nail art up the wall um but that's usually like maybe three hours but it's rare if i do a three hour appointment it's usually a two hour appointment for all, um, most of my clients but yeah you guys um i don't know what i'm gonna put usually i have my netflix on so let's see what's on netflix actually let me come this way because the lighting if oh shoot let me see if my clients actually right, you guys so i just finished my client she ended up getting these really cute nails i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys them i'm really happy with the turnout you guys will most likely see these ahead of this video just because i think they look so cute and i want to post them right now um but but they were so cute. She was really happy. I was really happy. Um, but now uh, I just got done cleaning up, wiping my stuff down. And now I'm just going to go ahead and film some tutorials. Um, and get ahead for some of my stuff that I have planned for for you guys so i mean now i just have all like a good amount of time so i'm just gonna go ahead and clean up and film and maybe do some tiktoks and things like that that i need to do and yeah Okay. 
guys sorry i have music playing but this is basically how this set had turned out um i'm gonna go outside because i am actually going to be doing this blood drip type of um nail art on them but i want to be able to get um more than one photo out out of them so that is kind of a hack for you guys if you guys are struggling having a crap ton of content for your instagram because i know a lot of people they put a, <laughs> i don't know i feel like a lot of pressure of having like a lot of different looks on my instagram so i do try to showcase some different things okay and now i'm just gonna go outside i do have a jean jacket that i do use oh where's my phone uh -oh. oh my phone's still up here i need to shut off my light So I will usually take this a board out there with me. I got this from the craft store and I think it was like seven bucks for it, but it's a double sided board. This side's pink, this side's white. Um, I know it's kind of obnoxious and then I have my rings on and then I think that's it. I don't know. I might use even use my dress, like kind of just like put it up against me like that. I don't know. So I am going to be doing pictures. My backyard is kind of crazy, so um, if you guys do see it, uh, please don't judge me. I need to empty out my pool um, and get that stuff together. But I like to go outside. I know some people, they don't like, br like bright, bright light. But I don't, or I actually like it. I prefer it. Alright, you guys, so, let's see. Alright, I'm actually going to be leaving my stuff right here just because I am going to be coming out again and I'm going to be fin basically finishing up the set and I am going to be doing another one. Um, I might do a little bit different of a background, but I'm going to go ahead and get started finishing up these nails and show you guys basically the pictures that I had took. Alright, you guys, shoo! This is the look. You guys are going to want to stay tuned of how I created this. So make sure to follow me because um, we are going to be showing you guys how to do this. This set is so cute. Um, I'm definitely feeling the Halloween vibe. So we are going to be doing a lot, a lot, a lot of Halloween stuff. So stay tuned for that. Alright you guys, so I did end up finishing my sets. I went outside again, took pictures of the other ones. I'll go ahead and insert them right here. Just so you guys can kind of see what to look forward to. Alright you guys, I am finally done with all of the stuff that I have been doing. I do still need to clean up my desk. That is a whole nother situation over there. But I do kind of want to sit down and talk with you guys and touch base just because um, I know with content creating it is kind of overwhelming so basically what I'll do or what I like to do is kind of recycle my sets just because not all the time we're able to create something from scratch and you're just trying to get as many looks out there as possible so with that being said that's basically what I was trying to do is get as many looks as I can out there just so I could um kind of sprinkle them out there with some of my other work and so I am always able to post something and I like to do the reels so I'll do some reels I'll do some tiktoks um and things like that but yeah you guys that is pretty much it for that work that I have to do at my desk. Now I'm going to sit down and do my computer. And basically with my computer, what I do is kind of just 
anything that is on my SD chips, I start to edit and upload. So I know this this is kind of tedious. All right, you guys, right here I did want to show you guys what I like to do. So basically, I end up uploading, and if anything needs to be linked or anything like that, I go ahead and put that down below. Um, and so I'll look up all of my links. I didn't have to do that because I already did that. And then I start editing more things. And then while I am importing more things, I go ahead and write down anything that I need to write down. And um, what my planner is for, I know this might seem a little bit backwards, but for my mental health, I thought it was a lot better to write down my accomplishments that I did throughout the day. So all the things that I was happy that I did work-wise, I put down in my calendar and just so um, I could just be proud of the things I did complete. And then right here I am just reposting anything of my work that has been shared. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that. And then I write down any other ideas that I might have or might want to do. Or if there are certain things that I am editing. If I am editing a video, I write down certain things where I need to input pictures and things like that. Just so I don't forget. Just because sometimes it does happen. We are human. But yeah, you guys. This is pretty much what I do. And I listen to my videos over making sure that everything is to my liking. Alright you guys, I know I said I was going to eat good, but when I needed my coffee, I just ended up doing, save me some calories, I did end up doing almond milk, and then after I am having an ice cream, just because I definitely need one. But it's a Hodge and Dodge, and it's so freaking good. If you guys haven't tried these, definitely try these out. <laughs> Alright you guys, I am going to go ahead and close out today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching A Day in the Life with me. I look kind of crazy right now. I took off my eyelashes, but we're going to go have dinner at my grandparents' house and then call it a night. But thank you guys so much. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. And as always, I'll be back with more videos. Bye.